The recording of the last meeting between Vladimir Putin and his Belarusian colleague and friend Alexander Lukashenko gave a unique insight into the situation in which the Russian Empire finds itself. His closest associates criticize him for his approach to the war in Ukraine, but his problems don't end there. Perhaps Lukashenko taught him that the Russians are running away from mobilization. But he took decisively from much larger forces, no. A video of the meeting between the two presidents was posted on the Kremlin's official website, showing Putin nervously tapping his foot on the floor as Lukashenko explained what was happening at the borders. The head of the Kremlin appeared uncomfortable during Lukashenko's monologue. In the mentioned meeting, he spoke very little, while Lukashenko gave the main speech. Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan said he had discussed Crimea several times with his Russian counterpart Vladimir Putin, asking him to return Crimea to its rightful owners. Since 2014. We have been talking about this with my dear friend Putin and we have been asking for it. We demanded that Crimea be returned to its rightful owners. They are also our descendants who live there. Erdogan said and added that no step has been taken in this direction. Asked what the end of the war in Ukraine should look like. Erdogan said that the land occupied by the Russians should be returned to Kiev. Kazakhstan's president also again condemned the conflict in Ukraine and called for respect for territorial integrity as Russia holds referendums in four Ukrainian regions on annexation to Moscow. The territorial integrity of the state must be inalienable, it is a key principle, said the president. There is a big war going on in our immediate neighborhood. We must remember this. Thinking first of all about our security, added Tokayev. A former Soviet republic in Central Asia, Kazakhstan is an ally of Russia and a member of the Economic and Customs Union with Russia, and also has good relations with the West and China. Russia's offensive in Ukraine has raised fears among some in Kazakhstan that they too could become targets of Russian ambitions especially because of the long border with Russia and the large Russian minority.